Hey, this is Brian. Thanks so much for watching Keys Motorsports. If you like our videos, be sure to give us a thumbs up. Make sure to subscribe, hit the bell notification, and check us out at keysmotorsports.com. Now, if you've been following our videos, you'll know that we just completed the Pure Stage 2 Turbo Upgrade on this N55 335 X Drive, and it's amazing. So today, we're going to take it to the track. And to help us capture the moment, Van True was kind enough to send us the N2 Pro Dash Cam, which is going to give us some amazing 1080 shots of forward facing, and it has a camera on the back too, next to the screen, so you can record what's happening in the cabin and in front of the car at the same time. Now the car isn't quite ready for prime time. As soon as we did the turbo upgrade, we had some pretty bad misfiring actually, so we had to go and get some different plugs. We're gonna make a video on that so that you don't have that problem. We've also had some issues with the fuel pump and I'm currently working with Kerry Jordan on a custom tune. Again, it's not quite ready yet, but today is the last day of the year that Aco Raceway is going to be open. Otherwise, they're gonna close for the winter. They're gonna reopen in the spring, so I just can't wait that long. <laughs> All right, and we are here. Let's see how many cars are here today. Oh my gosh. There's like a thousand cars. I've never seen the line this long in my life. It probably has to do with it being the last day of the year. But hopefully we can get in maybe two runs or so. Uh, my friend's coming with his Audi, so that should be fun. The good thing about coming four hours after they open is there's no line to get in. I guess that's a plus. But what's not a plus is there's some kind of Mopar event today. So they jacked the price up, it's 40 bucks. It's normally 25. How you doing? Racing? Yep, 40? just testing too, thanks. Weird, I'm not used to this day racing. I gotta race at night. All right, I'm gonna pull over, fill this out, go through tech inspection, and we'll talk again. All right, so there are so many cars here, you can't even get in line. They're just making us wait uh, while all these other cars go which is fine, I just hope we can get at least two runs in today, that's kind of my goal, but there are a crazy amount of people here, so hopefully we can make that happen. All right, so we've waited about three hours, and I think we're gonna make our first run. We shall see. So with this, I'm going to be running it in Sport Plus, and I have the automatic gear selector over to the left, all right, so while I'm doing my run here, I also have my boot mode app open. We're going to data log while we're doing it. Like I said before, we're still working out my tune. So I'm not worried about the safety or anything, but just want to make sure that we get a good sense of what's going on with this car. Now, whenever you're data logging, make sure that you hit the button and then you wait about five seconds. You don't want to hit it and go, because otherwise you may not get the best read. Awesome. There's definitely a little bit of work that still can be done to work out my tune. But man, for the most part, that was awesome. That was the fastest I think I've ever gone down a track in my life. I am so excited right now. You have no idea. Thank you. You're welcome. You dirty dog. I got a 12.052. 12.052. Oh man. So close. So close, so close. Hopefully we can do it one more time and see if we can get it, but. There's our slip here. All right, the Mustang next to me ran like a 10 last time, so let's see how we do with this one here. Just waiting for him to, to line up. strong. I don't know, it felt deceiving. I don't know if it felt better or worse than last time. It kind of felt around the same. 
Thank you. Ladies and gentlemen, we did an 11.9. Yes! That was awesome. We did it! Celebratory burbles. You will not believe what I ran. Did you run a 12.0? No. 12.3? I ran a 12-4. <laughs> you did run a 12-3. I did. Holy crap. I ran a 12-3. I ran a 12-3. <laughs> Holy crap. Let's talk about something. <laughs> Your reaction time. <laughs> it horrible. sucks. <laughs> it's I jumped the oh gun. I, I was a minus oh, one wow. nine. You were a positive <laughs> nine. A you waited a second. It was like green. Oh, shoot. Yes! 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 You did 11.9! <laughs> Dude, that's 11.9.3! Yeah. 12.3! What? what just a JV4. <laughs> On, On an S. 2017 <laughs> Audi S3. 12.3. A JV4 installed by Keys Motorsports, yes, I'll have by you. by Keys Motorsports, and I had 20s on. <laughs> he has... Believe. I have 20s on. <laughs> I wonder if it's too dark. We gotta show people your, your 20s. He's got these 20 inch wheels on here that he got super cheap and each one weighs like 60 pounds. <laughs> I was actually so happy when my thing draggy said 12.4. The draggy said 12.4 and I was already happy. I didn't realize that this thing actually said, what was that? 12.3? <laughs> That's incredibly accurate. How about like your 60 foot and stuff? Is that accurate? Foot, uh, oh no, it doesn't. It doesn't. Zero to 60. That has zero to 60. Not six. No, it doesn't have the 60. That's cool foot. though. I will say, <laughs> that looks pretty cool. And Audi seats are super soft. Doesn't make me want to buy Audi seats. It's like but I really sitting like on it. a lamb. It, it is. It's, inc it's incredibly soft, especially soft. compared to my car. But what do you think about this? How, how do you feel right now? I, um, we both just yeah, ran. We ran the times that we wanted to run. Below 12s in the 11s. This is amazing. Yeah. <laughs> you did a really good time because it's not just, like, you know what I'm saying? It's like 12, nine, 11, 9, 3. Yeah. Like you could be in the 8s. 11, 8. <laughs> yeah. So I was like, geez. What did you do different? I shifted. When I start to fall unstableness, I shift it. Yeah. And he did it with a big gulp. <laughs> wait, wait, wait. Open your trunk. We need to show the world your trunk. Look at this. This is ridiculous. Tools. What? You have like tools, tools. I got tools, tools. I got tools in there too. Tools. And I got a full cleaning part. <laughs> and I have my full spare. <laughs> it's still underneath there. So as you just saw, our goal was to run 11.9 and we did it. And we can't wait to do even better next time. So like I was saying, we weren't 100% ready for the track. We we're actually maxing out the high pressure fuel pump. So we're gonna do some other things that we're not gonna talk about right this second. That's going to help us get even faster, which is super excited. Once again, we wanted to say thank you to Vantru for sending us this um, dash camera. As a content creator, they always say the best camera that you can have is the one that's with you. So that's why you find a lot of vloggers and whatnot just using their cell phone to film half their videos. So I would actually go out on a limb because of how high quality this camera is and how good the audio sounds that if you're a vlogger, you can just be driving in your car and make a vlog, download the videos, and I think it would sound and look great. What I've realized over time is even if your audio and video isn't 100% perfect, content is still better than no content. So the last thing I'll say on this is if you are interested in a Vantrue dash camera, be sure to see the link in the description. And thanks again for sending us this. Once again, my name is Brian. Thanks so much for watching Keys Motorsports. Be sure to give us a thumbs up. Make sure to subscribe, hit the bell notification. And if you're interested in BMW retrofits, performance upgrades, or aesthetics for your car, be sure to check us out at keysmotorsports.com. Once again, my name is Brian. Thanks so much for watching. Have a great day.